I just found out about the worst day an F1 driver has ever had. At the 1977 German Grand Prix, Hans Heyer managed to not qualify for the race, not finish the race, and be disqualified from the race afterwards, meaning he picked up a DNQ, a DNF, and a DSQ, all in the same Grand Prix. This was back when Formula One had 30 cars enter a race weekend, but only 24 spaces on the grid come race day. So the slowest six drivers in qualifying wouldn't take part in the Grand Prix. Hans was one of those six, so that should have been the end of his weekend. However, in the race as the Grand Prix was set to begin, there was a fault with the starting lights, and Hans Heyer took this opportunity to sneak out of the pit lane and join the other cars on track, hoping that he wouldn't be noticed, which he somehow wasn't. He managed to actually join the race and complete eight laps of the Hockenheim circuit before a gearbox failure brought him to a stop. Once he was brought back into the pits, the FIA noticed he was disqualified from a race he shouldn't have been part of, and then given a five-race ban from Formula One.